we have been applying styrene strips to uh, to make super elevated curves. One is a real broad curve, so we did very broad uh, super elevated curves through the whole transition, and then we went back into the actual sharper curves, and we want the the effect of the train to have the lean to it as it snakes through the curves, and, and I think we got what we're looking for. And now we're about to see. We're just doing a little test run, see how it transitions. That's it. That got enough lean to it. Look pretty good going through there. Back on a level trail. Oh, yeah. That's in super. This should be full super now. Oh, yeah. It should have pretty good lean. Won't fall over. Straightens back up again. Yep. Now it's getting ready to hit. It's going into a minor super. And then it's getting ready to start into a super again. And it's going into full super right there. Oh, well, that's nice. That's yeah. nice. Yeah, We're going to a close spike. Yeah. Okay, I'm trying to line up these two switches to where the rails, we will put a short piece in between the, the rails of the switch coming across. Okay, now, so what we got is a straight shot. Now we'll just, we'll just have to put a small piece in between these two and that way I know where to drill for this one and for this one for where the uh, the switch machines going so that's it right there by making a certain number of angle irons to, to get us going would that be a good idea and just call start it? start at four foot spreads and then Make that our magic number. Start to get back four. down here. That's what I'm thinking. Okay. If we do four foot spreads. Oh, let's have a tape measure. So. I'll take it in. Go your way. And we'll start on this wall coming this way. Right. We want to come from the helix and yeah. come back. We need to pick something. Okay, so we're 20 feet. Okay, that's five. Okay. No, that's six. Six. Oh, yeah. You got an end. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Excuse me, sir. And then you're going to put one on the corner. Or are you going to put a, a 90 in there? Um, it would be great if you can put a 90 in there, but. A 90. And a 90. The 45. Okay, so, so that's 12. Yeah, you want, yeah. And a half. <laughs> so that's 12 and a half. So 20, 12 and a half. 32 and a half. You're gonna run out of tape. And then to right here is say 24. It's about 23 and a half. That's 56 and a half. 56 and a half divided by four. You gotta add a few extras in there. Yeah. So if it's six and a half divided by four. So six plus another um, six, seven. Plus that down there. Twelve down there. So that's four, five. Six, twelve, thirteen, got eighteen. Eighteen so far, plus you got, we got to do this over here. Well, that's not going to come out eighteen inches though. Okay, so all the eighteen is going to be right here. 
Yeah, well, it'll go on past the fireplace and then it turns into something smaller when it makes the corner. Do this, just round it off. Just go ahead and make it 20. You got 18 at least back there. Okay. You're going to need one here and you're going to at least need one right there. That's 20. Okay. That's probably about 5 feet. Okay. So I'm making them come out. I'm making them come out 18 inches. How far down do they need to go? Have, have him do 21. And that'll take. That'll give us one extra if we have to. Okay. Now you're coming out 18. Come down nine inches, eight inches. 21. Well, you got. Uh, understand you're going to have two foot. I mean two inches on top of that. So over here, but instead I'm, of 20, I'm we're thinking of the 18. If you took half the load off at nine inches, at 45 degrees, that would be nine inches in and nine inches down. And this thing will support incredible weight. I know. Yeah. Oh yeah. So they don't have to be coming down far. But you still need something to bite into the wall. Yeah. So right there is where it's going to be. I'm thinking eight or nine inches, Jim. Nine inches would be right there. We're coming out 18. Right. You, I'm just doing the math. You take half the load back. Nine at 45, inches. 9, and 9, you're, you're halfway into an 18-inch yeah. mm -hmm. module. That takes out half the stress load right there. 